everyone, I'm here to do another book haul. Half of them I purchased and half of them are bargain books. I'm going to go through the bargain books first. The first book I picked up is Carrie by Stephen King. Um, I've never read a Stephen King novel. I know. I'm not one for scary-ish books and a lot of his seem to have some kind of scary element to them. But I've seen the trailer for the newer carry adaptation and it doesn't really seem scary as much as it just seems suspenseful I don't know but uh, and it, the storyline seems really interesting so I want to kind of read the book just to see if I will like it and then go see the movie for those of you who know me and watch my videos if you know that there's another Stephen King novel out there that I might actually like Please let me know because I want to read more of his stuff, so yeah. The next one I picked up at a bargain shop was The Lost Symbol by Dan Brown. The fourth book, um, Inferno, is coming out sometime this month and I haven't even read the third one. So um, I want to read this one so that I can read Inferno when it comes out. Shoo. Got that. And then the next nine are the first nine books in a series and I was super, super excited. I found this almost this entire series at this um, used bookshop. I traded in some books and got credit towards some of them, so I didn't really spend... I probably didn't buy any of these books. I probably more spent, I think, this bigger one here was like two dollars and something like that. So, and that is... I got the first nine books in the House of Night series by PC Cast and Kristen Cast, and that is the first one, Marked, Betrayed, Chosen, Untamed, Hunted, Tempted, Burned, Awakened, and Book 9, Destiny. I'm just missing the last one, which I believe is called Hidden, I want to say. Yes, I think it's called Hidden. When I got a value from here, I don't mind going to the bookstore and actually purchasing the last book because I got a really good steal on these, and so that's all of them. They look so beautiful next to each other. I love the spines. The next group of books is actually ones that I did purchase. I got Professor Gagawa and Slither Sisters. These are book one and book two in the Tales of Lovecraft Middle School series. I cannot wait to get to this series. I've heard so many good things about these books. And of course, the covers are beautiful. The next book I picked up, Wedding Night by Sophie Kinsella. You guys know that I loved I've Got Your Number, and so I wanted to pick this one up. I really like the cover, too. The next book I got, I originally picked up because it was going to be for the YT Book Club, and I just never got to reading it, and that is Falling Kingdoms by Morgan Rhodes. The reason I didn't get to reading this before the YT Book Club did their chat is because I ordered this online, and it didn't get to me on time. I think it just got to me, like, maybe May 1st or so. Next book I picked up is The Summoning by Kelly Armstrong. Then I also got I Hunt Killers by Barry Liga. Liga? Something like that. Um, the sequel, which I think is called The Game or Game, just came out. And so I want to see what that's all about. So I picked that one up. Speaking of sequels, I got Eternity Cure by Julie Kagawa. This is book two in the Mortal Rules series. I forget what the actual series is called, but the first book is Immortal Rules, and this is book two, Eternity, Eternity Cure. And I took the flap off. Um, the actual book has a cover with the girl on it that actually matches the first one a little bit better, because the first one has a person on it, and so does this one. While well, this one's got like, these like veins or something on them. And I thought that was pretty cool. That's the spine. The spine is gorgeous. And then I picked up a few newer books, which, the, and the first one I got is Gorgeous by Paul Rudnick. This one sounded pretty interesting. I, I want to say this has some fantasy elements to it, but I'm not too sure on that. The next book I picked up purely by the cover. I'm not too sure what it's about. I did read the inside flap and I remember thinking it was good so we'll have to see. The Ability by M. M. Vaughan? Vaughn? Monica Mira Vaughn. But look at the cover. It 
It is so pretty. So pretty. I really, really love the shade of purple and the lettering, the font, this cool ribbon thing here. It's really interesting. This is a bad boy named Christopher who has special talents and ends up going to an academy because of it. He can enter people's minds, goes to school to learn more about his ability and what it can do. And then the last, Let the Sky Fall by Shannon Messenger. And everybody's been talking about this book and I cannot wait to get to it. Those are all the books I've picked up recently. If you've read any of the books that I've mentioned or have any comments to say, please leave them down below and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.